sleep. Hey, what's up, man? How you doing? Yeah, Oscar, what's up? No, I'm keeping it tranquilo, bro. You know, I mean, demand is crazy down south, man. Crazy. Yeah, well, you know, the feds, they're not supplying the arms to the Mexican criminals, so someone's got to step it. Oh, yeah, they need guns, bro. So many guns. But luckily for us, they're easily acquired up here. Yeah, well, that's our freedom's gift to the world, right? You American? Man, I didn't even know. Anyway, shit, that's gonna be profitable for the both of us. But completion is tough, bro. To control the market down there, uh, we gotta control supply up here. We got a couple local contracts to help us out stateside, so this plane is loaded with their shipments. You make a couple drops, you come back here. Uh, you know, they say that the American industry is suffering, but uh, you and I, <laughs> we got a good export store. Ah, okay. Ah, I'll be on the radio, man. That's great. of your finest taxi cab, please. No problem. I'll have one there in a couple of minutes. Much obliged. Sonora Desert. Hey, we're here. You sure as shit are one dumb, ignorant, white trash hillbilly, Wallace. <laughs> You're damn right! <laughs> Chang, spreadsheet. Let's head outside and talk terms. La 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 la. Quite <laughs> Gentlemen, I think I have proved that my organization can handle weight. And I think I have proved that my organization is a reliable supplier. In short, it's you, and me. Now give me some of that goddamn X. I'm afraid we want to go down a different path. What? We want to explore other opportunities. Shut the fuck up! Our boss, Mr. Cheng's father, wants something a little larger. We want to move drugs, perhaps guns. This is my life's work. I mean, since I was a little kid, I, I dreamt big. You know, I've always wanted to be an international drug dealer and, and a weapons trader. All right, so I'm begging you. Let's make this happen. I'm very sorry. You're sorry? You're fucking sorry? I just spilled my fucking guts out to you, and you say to me you're sorry. Who are you working with? Hmm? I'm not at liberty to say... Oh, no, 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 you're at fucking liberty. In fact, I'd say you are obliged. Who? Fucking who? 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 The O'Neill brothers. The O'Neill brothers, huh? Yeah. You shitting me? No. 
Cause those fucking O'Neill brothers, I hear a little birdie telling me that they have a bit of a problem. Since one of them's gonna have to be surgically removed from the skull of the other, fuck you guys, and fuck them! <laughs> You're awful! Every last one of you! Mm, so close I could taste it! A small pack! I call my own on this godforsaken earth! You assholes! Fuck! 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 Oh my god! Oh! Motherfucker! Phillips! Elwood O'Neill! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Trevor, it's business! That wide-eyed idiot was mine! It's business, fella! You wanna discuss it? We're at the farm. Ernie, Earl, Walton, Wynn, Dale, Doyle, Daryl, Dan, all of us! Star Rut, how much of a family meth business you got when I'm done? Mm. Oh, oh, you are going to die! I just spoke to that maniac, Trevor. He's coming. Get down to the meth lab to protect it. Right. I hope he don't get through these idiots, but we know they're idiots. Come on, let's go see them Chinese fellas. Oh, how many brothers you got, you inbred freaks. I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I'll kill the lot of you, and I'll torch your cookhouse.
right. Fuck Trevor Phillips, man. Yeah. You're all dead. Oh. You gonna be buried in this basement. Come on. He ain't taking our crank. Chester is down. Disrespectful pricks! 